The royal goes beyond having a fantastic wardrobe. Fairy tale love stories, world travel and 24-7 comforts. It's not all plain sailing, as they also have responsibilities, obligations and strict rules to follow. The British Crown has a protocol that covers everything from dress to forms of entertainment such as board games. According to their strict protocol, the royal family is forbidden to play Monopoly because the game tends to get out of control among members of the Crown. That information was revealed in December 2008, when Prince Andrew visited the newly renovated Albion Street headquarters of Leeds Building Society one of the world's most prestigious mortgage and savings companies. As a gift to mark his visit, the financier presented him with a famous board game. However, the monarch had to refuse it. We are not allowed to play Monopoly at home. The Duke of York explained that his family is forbidden to play Monopoly, because it easily becomes a vice. He also indicated that the game often causes arguments among the royals, because the competition becomes vicious. At the moment we don't know if the youngest members of the family, such as Prince George or Princess Charlotte have had the opportunity to play Monopoly, but it's very likely not, as the children of the monarchy also have a strict protocol. Will they be able to play it when Queen Elizabeth II is not present? The children of the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge have found other forms of entertainment. Recently, William and Kate confessed that their children spend their time doing schoolwork remotely. So, everything indicates that the royal family will never feel the thrill when acquiring an imaginary property. Though it probably doesn't keep them awake at night. It's curious how belonging to a specific lineage can cause them to miss out on everyday things. We hope that any future royal family members that marry into the family aren't fans of Monopoly as they will never be able to play it again. Can you imagine not being able to play one of the classic and most popular board games ever?